We know that stress is the universal factor in virtually all diseases and that stress triggers inflammation and pain. Who manages our stress? It's the genome which contains the knowledge on how to biochemically mediate all different kinds of stress, conscious and subconscious stress. What is the genome? The genome is your DNA, the code of life that acts like software mediating genetic expression with environmental demands. Millions of genes are populated across the genome. Where is that genome? It's in the nucleus of each cell. So what can be done to reduce epigenetic stress? Lots of things. The most fundamental choice supporting a healthy genome is a healthy diet, physical activity, spiritual grounding, etc. Those are your lifestyle choices helping to control your environment. What the show method teaches is how to find and determine hidden stress factors above and beyond common sense lifestyle choices, and then modulate epigenetic and inborn stressors at the functional level. It addresses the ultimate stress factor, mutations and SNPs, which are errors within the DNA causing metabolic stress. Allergies being one important example. What does modulating inborn metabolic stressors mean? It means eliminating food sensitivities from metabolism and harmonizing an overactive immune system. Metabolism, which includes processing of all foods as well as operating the immune system, is governed by our DNA and expressed through millions of genes. Metabolism is conducted by epigenetics. So how can these stressors which trigger inflammation be assessed and identified? Particularly subconscious stress and how can we influence epigenetics? A big step in consciousness is to realize that life is orchestrated at the cellular level. 100 trillion cells make us live. Each cell contains the code of life, the entire DNA, in its nucleus. That means the DNA is in our body 100 trillion times. 100 trillion times. These 100 trillion cells communicate with each other intensely to coordinate the biochemistry of life. Now, it just happens to be a fact of life that the average human has thousands of imperfections in that genetic operating code, the DNA. Thousands of mutations and SNPs. This is the most serious stress for us to deal with because it impairs our ability to run a smooth metabolism. A smooth metabolism would be to detox efficiently, to metabolize nutrients perfectly, to deal with physical stress easily, to manage psychological stress effortlessly, to eliminate every virus quickly. The show method enables us to listen to the body's cellular communications and pick up on the quirks within. Identifying inflammatory triggers. How do we accomplish that? At the core of the show method is a fusion of the ancient Chinese concept of qi energy and meridian energy channels with modern information technology and epigenetic science. That mystical energy, that mystical qi energy can be compared to cellular communication data, a form of energy. The show method then strives to put together an effective modulatory feedback to harmonize epigenetic expression by modulating that qi energy very specifically and detailed. While this can be done with energy imprinted vials, the iMate quantum biofeedback technology helps the practitioner to first quickly sort through the thousands of possible stressors and detect the pertinent ones. Second, to analyze the cellular response to a database of nu nutrients, microbes and chemicals at the epigenetic level or the protein level. And third, to assemble a set of frequencies allowing to modulate that epigenetic expression with an energetic feedback, allowing the cells to produce the right set of enzymes, the right balance of body biochemicals and proteins for a stress-reduced metabolism, a harmonious metabolism that generates less inflammation. Let me list some of the stressors we need to check for. Allergies, which cons constitutes foods and its smallest components, vitamins, amino acids, fatty acids, phenols, minerals. Airborne allergies, like pollen and molds and farming chemicals, inhalants of all kinds. 
infections, viruses, bacteria, fungi, parasites, emotional stressors, mother-in-law, kids, the boss, mental stressors like anger, fear, and guilt, and toxins, chemical toxins, pharmaceutical food additives, pesticides, fungicides, antibiotics in meat, hormones in animal products. There's mental toxins like negative TV, radio, and then there's environmental stressors, hot, cold, humid. We have to respond, our bodies have to respond to all of those stressors at any given moment. That's why we have to check all these many stressors because the biochemical or energetic management of these stressors require different sets of genes to turn on and off and produce the proper metabolic proteins. But there are SNPs and mutations spread across those genes causing metabolic stress. We identify those problematic genes by the stressors that cause an energetic reaction. Oftentimes it's an overlay of many of these stressors which trigger the inflammatory response and a reason why the body may feel different levels of stress or pain on different days. I'm very excited about the show method. It has helped me tremendously to desensitize myself and have less inflammatory events. Some of the amazing stories of resolving odd symptoms which emerge from my clinic amongst thousands of patients can be found in my book 1000 Shades of Pink. We now have the ability to change the course of allergies and other inflammatory stressors by communicating with the DNA and de-stress some of the simpler genetic mutations by harmonizing them energetically. This has allowed many people to overcome some of their allergic events that cause all kinds of inflammatory conditions simply by reducing metabolic stress using this energy medicine technique. To learn more about my show method, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and find seminar information at my website smarthealthforyou.org.